bizarre holes were burrowed into the forest floor. Hey, how'd my coin get down there? Triumph? How'd you get up there? Triumph's stomach seemed to have led him into trouble. I'd have to find a way to get him down. All right, sugar shrooms. Starberries framed a serene view. Shame about that buzzing beehive, though. My love, you're my everything. I might not have enough money for a ring yet, but I just can't wait any longer. Will you be mine forever? Bees Day, <laughs> that lovely meal. I tucked the berries away for later, even though I was craving a cliffside snack. Sugar shrooms look amazing. Just the right amount of shroomy and not too sugary. Now, if you can find me the starberries, she's all yours for the discounted rate of one shiny gold coin. These starberries are perfectly ripe, just squishy enough, and with a faint scent of musky cabbage. Now, if you pass me one shiny gold coin, Grandma's giant star shroom pie is all yours. Oh, thanks for the patronage. Share this pie with a friend or two, or three. <laughs> and good luck in the tournament. I never waste food. Thanks for the momentary lapse in conversation. Ulfi was unquestionably hangry. Now that I am refurbished, I'll allow you to cross. Though a quick-footed peacock already got to that snarling snarlax. Oh, I almost forgot. Goosey, 
For your act of kindness, Alfie would like you to have this. Whenever you need me, just give it a blow. Step lively. Alfie needs to get back to the guild meeting. It's almost croissant time. He is a weak link. He probably knows we don't have the croissant. As long as he knows the password, we have to let him in. And now, now, Pilar, I don't know if I'd say hey, it like that. Hey, my coin! I wish Ophie would stay put. This meeting is already way over schedule. Snarlies, Snarlax with the six legs, three claws, and one tooth from this distance. Gross. Next item up for discussion, should we lift our embargo on the consumption of goats? Ah, oh, I long for the days of feasting on roasted goat leg with a nice aged raclette. <laughs> Pilar, everyone knows there are no more goats in Daventry. Only majestic unicorns. <laughs> Alfie, there is no such thing. That's what he had. I've seen him. Alfie, he pulled a fast one on you, you fathead. Well, everyone else calls them majestic unicorns. Ah, uh, Alfie, if everyone jumped off a... well, my back, would you? Use your head and think for yourself. Or use your lips and close your mouth. Titwa! Okie dokie then. I think we should table this for next week. You'd think with his giant head, there'd be a brain bigger than a macaroon. Orfie, you're so easily tricked into sitting down. You should stand up for our rights. Well, easy. But Alfie likes sitting down. You must now do the secret knock. Motion to nominate Pilar for the position. And now, Pilar, you know you can't nominate yourself. Uh, does anyone else want What's to nominate this doing our here? Sergeant of Arms Pilar for Grand Counselor? No, I want you, Mr. Waddles. Ah, oh, jeez, guys, who would have thunk that an average bridge troll like me from a small town creek could grow to be the head of the second largest field Shortcut. in the Midwestern Brilliant. hemisphere? Brilliant. But it's time for me to suspend my work here and give my family the support they need. Let's move this item to the top. Thanks for getting Ulfie out of there. That meeting was getting heated. It better come soon. What is the knock? And the password. Trust me. <laughs> Très bien. Where do you keep going, Olfi? Olfi has very important business to attend to. Have the croissants arrived yet? Ah, I... Continue with the secret knock. And then? Continue. Then? Nearly there. What's the password? Um... Trust me? That is correct. 
Hold on. Hey, you. You don't look like a troll. You look like a scab. And I love the taste of scabs. Mmm, delicious. He's no scab. He's a goose. And Ulfie's friend. Let him in, Pilar. He might have our snacks. Any friend of Ulfie's is... usually make-believe. I can't believe you don't recognize your own brethren. I, too, am a bridge troll. See? You are? Why didn't you just say so? Well, I... I... I, I know that often bridge trolls from different regions can sometimes be at war, and I'm just here passing through. And or not, you must prove you are indeed a troll. Why don't you join me in the secret dance of the bridge troll guild? And we'll find out. I somehow doubt that's the full truth. Yeah. Oh, can't stop. All right. Well, there you have it, Pilar. He sure does seem like a troll to me. Mr. Bridge Goose representing Ludor, on behalf of myself, the Grand Counselor of the Daventry Bridge Troll Guild, I would like to welcome you to our chapter meeting. It'll be wonderful to have an outsider's opinion on our strike. As long as he sides with me, it will be wonderful. Since I am sick of supporting the people of Daventry, I have collected all of the troll horn mouthpieces. They cannot be used anymore. Golly gosh, Pilar, that... that seems a bit extreme. Not extreme enough. We need to destroy these horns once and for all. We need to make a statement. We are not at their beck and call. Daventry has burned their bridges with us, and I will set fire to all these horns. Um... Where are your horns, Pilar? Mine are already up on the hill, where I will take all of these. Everyone will be able to see them burn. You, newcomer, throw in whatever is used to summon you. You are a part of this. How cute. A little bridge bell for a little goose. Okay, well... Uh, according to the agenda, uh, the next line item we need to discuss is our negotiation tactics. What is our strategy for getting those guards to stop stomping around on our backs? Oh, oh, oh! They should cross barefoot without their sharp heels! I think we should feast on their legs and force them to crawl over our backs. Okay, now... Both interesting perspectives, I hear you, but we gotta find a way for us all to be successful. Uh, what do you think, Bridge Goose? I think I'm with Ulfie on this one. <laughs> Thanks. Good thinking, friend. A point taken. Moving on. Switching topics. Ulfie, it's your turn to bring the snacks next week. Do we want sweet or salty? Ulfie loves the taste of sweet. Ulfie. You are an unrefined swine. Savory is the only snack accepted by my palate. You both bring up good points. 
But we have to come together on this. Uh, what do you think, Bridge Goose? I have a little sweet tooth myself. Mmm, sweetie cakes. A happy tum-tum makes a happy friend. Okay, continuing forward. We need to decide on our team jackets. The tailor cannot wait any longer for our final decision. Ulfie is a fan of the majestic unicorn and butterfly logo with the slogan, Building Bridges to the Future. No. Our jacket needs to be exciting. We should go with something epic. Something that will burn into their minds. We should go with trolls eating humans with the slogan, Feed the Trolls. Okay, okay, those are both great points, but we really need to find a side to align on and work together. Uh, what do you think, Bridge Goose? I'm gonna go with Ulfie on this. I love butterflies and unicorns. A bridge to friendship is the best way to solve this. Next item, negotiation tactics. Getting guards to step softly across our backs. Make them walk barefoot. Eat their legs and force them to crawl across. Guys, I feel like we're talking in circles here. Th that's it. Waddles is right. We're repeating ourselves. I'm taking my horn and leaving until you sort this out. Okay, then, uh, really, uh, well, then, uh, this, uh, meeting should be adjourned anyway. I had tricked them. That bell was of little use to me, but Waddle's horn was sure to blow open new paths. is not easy to ignite. She seemed to enjoy snack breaks more than trying to light a fire. Get away from my raison croissant. Ils sont à moi. I can't take this stress. I need a snack. And that pile was the last horn I needed. To complete the set. Step right up. If you want to get burned. Oh, there must be some more kindling around here. Maybe if I just regain my strength. How to ride? I don't feel so good. Spin! Spin! Spinny! Spin! Shimmy! Shimmy, shimmy, shimmy! Shake! Shaky, shaky, shaky! Take a nap. I need a nap. This is just a crazy dream. You don't like the taste of lanky teenager. I now had the complete set. 